would like to sell your company, where do you begin? I'm Joe Cope. And I'm Luis Corrales from Cope Corrales. We're business and wealth advisors, and we work closely with company owners to help them build and grow wealth. Yeah. So whether you would like to be out of your company today, or you really haven't given much thought about selling your company, we know that you will exit. Now, for some people, that may just be shutting the doors and turning off the lights. But for others, they're going to walk away with a substantial check. Obviously, that ladder is more attractive. That ladder option is more attractive. What we can also tell you is very likely. But how do you get there? How do you begin the process? Yeah, where you begin is really based on you and your objectives. We call it your destination. Are you looking to build a $10 million yeah. company, a $50 million company, or a half a billion dollar company? The answer to that question will determine the paths we take, any strategies that we may pursue, and ultimately also who the potential buyers to your company would be. Yeah. We know there are four potential buyers for your company. The first are family members. The second are insiders or key employees. The third are strategic buyers, think competitors. And the fourth are financial buyers, think private equity. Which buyer is right for you is entirely dependent on what you want and the state of your company. Now the state of your company is likely quite complex and each buyer is looking at very different metrics. Some might be looking at whether you have key employees and management in place and you have compensation arrangements that are gonna keep them around. Others are gonna be cash flow plays. They're looking at your cash flows and sustainability. All those factors combined are going to create a value to each one of those particular buyers. Yeah, and certainly equally as important, we should also understand how your business plays a role in your personal finances. Yeah. We call it the state of the union of your finances. Many times we have found that company owners actually have offers on the table but they're chasing a number and they don't know how that number translates into your lifestyle requirements or your monthly income needs. Yeah. So how do we put all this together? Well, what we've created is a very brief but effective two-page assessment. Call it the business and personal finance state of the union. Uh, and we put that together as just some questions that help get you thinking as the business owner and gives us a head start on that likely destination, that likely buyer for you. Yeah, so like Joe mentioned, um, you can find a two, the two-page assessment, you can find it on our website, you can find it at the bottom of our video link. It's certainly a great starting point for us. We look forward to hearing from you, we look forward to having a conversation, we look forward to hopefully working together.